Hey, what is up heroes, and welcome back to more Pokemon Sign version. In the last episode, we explored Slate City, we bought a Porygon from a dodgy Team Rocket member, explored the Avalanche Mountain, and we found Team Rocket with Giovanni, who caught a Regice, which is pretty cool. And then I went back to the Slate City, Julie is still not there, so I think we have to go this way, because the Team Rocket member is now not blocking the path, and we can head through. Hopefully it won't be as glitchy as when we used the escape rope to get through, and it seems pretty good now. So let's go find this gym leader and send him back to the, uh, the gym. You made it for Avalanche Mountain too. I did. Pretty proud of myself to be honest. And you know, I like the buzz. Okay. Uh, let's go into our lovely bug. Go for some flame charges. I've noticed a lot of uh, trainers in this game like to use electric types. And right now, electric is not my uh, oh god strongest type to go against. Oh, that's fine. I put the XP share on a. Uh, Boulder, so he can hopefully evolve. Oh god, got fire type as well. Hopefully evolve after he grows one level, which we might get from these two if we're lucky. Critical hit, nice. I like the buzz. I reckon I can finish off just what one attack and I'm confused and yep, that's not going to happen. After a great start, can even grow a level. Okay, I think I have a revive, but I'm gonna. Save it just in case. It's not that far to go. Oh, it's Pokemon Center. I am so, so thankful I did not use the revive then. Otherwise, um, that would have been a waste. Such a huge waste. <laughs> oh my goodness. I love the uh, snow on the, the building. That looks really nice. Anyway, let's start heading through uh, this place. See if we can find the gym leader or whatever. I did it level 26. Damn. Level 23. Okay, we're about to revolve. Well, I think we should because we found that Dread Rock level 23. No, we're not going to evolve. Damn, that sucks. I'm the strongest of the Mimic Brothers. Okay. Go a level tw ooh, 27 Ditto. Another Ditto. Ha! Agility, no thank you. So we're going to get a few Pokemon level 30 and then... Oh, okay. I should be fine. Can easily take you out. Once Ribbing gets level 30 and Crocknall gets level 30. Oh, there we go, finally evolving. So if you missed last episode, I actually battled a trainer with the evolution of this Pokemon and it looks so good. Look at that, that looks great. Dreadrock. It's got a cool name as well. Magnitude, ah uh, yeah we can learn Magnitude. Get rid of Mud Slap, because Mud Slap kind of sucks. What I actually want to do right now is check the Pokedex and see if potentially it's got another evolution, because that would be pretty cool. So we're looking for it through here and... Where is it, where is it, where is it? It's quite far down. So Kangrish doesn't actually have another um, evolution, which kind of sucks. I don't really want to capture that anymore. That was the uh, kangaroo Pokemon the first gym leader had. Okay. It could potentially have another evolution. I like that. That's pretty good. Sup? It's so cold here. I wish it would stop snowing. No! The snow's awesome. I am praying this year in the United Kingdom we get snow. Haven't had snow in a long time. Have we had it this year? No, yeah, we have. We had it in like February this year. For like two days, and that was it. Uh, let's go into this. Level 27. The Pokemon again. a little bit tough around here, but we've got six Pokemon roughly the same level, so we're in a pretty decent position. What level was uh, Croconaw? Level 29. Let's get you level 30 first. Let's grab this TM as well. Focus Punch. Okay, not bad. Might as well beat that level 26 wild Pokemon, not bad. There's about to be a hidden item here. PP up, not bad. Quite like that. So far this hack, I am really, really enjoying. Enjoying this quite a lot. Like Liquid Crystal Nuzlocke. I think this was a Nuzlocke, it wasn't the most enjoyable Pokemon game I've done in a while. I'm kind of glad that's over now, but this, I am really enjoying this. Oh, one HP! 
Damn, I wanna, uh, I'm gonna heal up. Really enjoying this hack, I think it's really fun. I think it's because of the Fakey Mon, just make it a bit more exciting, you know? Some new Pokemon to play with. Any hack that introduces new mechanics, I really like. Like, um, Pokemon Life, the, uh, the alpha I played. If you missed that, it's, it's only four episodes long, they're really short, but... It was, that was such a great hack, like, I cannot wait for that game to be finished, which I don't think it's going to be finished for a very long time, but it was so good. So good. One of the best hacks I've ever played, 100%. Even though it was like an hour long, so good. But this, this is up there. I'm really enjoying this hack so far. Just hoping it doesn't get ruined. Because some hacks start off really well and then it just get really repetitive. Or do some really stupid stuff, like stupid puzzles. Nice. And crunch, let's get rid of bite. Can I- Oh, you're evolving level 30? Do you usually evolve at level 30? I haven't used a, uh, Turdile for Alligator in a very long time. I can't remember if it evolves at level 30 or not. I mean, it must do. It's been so long since I used one. To me, it's always been, a, I'm a Typhlosion sort of guy. I used to be Team for Alligator when I first started playing, like, um, Gold Silver Crystal when it came out. I did a, uh, <laughs> Friday get a, a Friday get a solo run once, which was pretty fun. It wasn't until, like, maybe a couple of years ago, I started using Cyndaquil and I, I really liked Typhlosion. He became my go-to guy. I should really stay in, but I kind of want to give it a bit of XP. I can probably take all these guys out with Aerial Ace and Quick Attack. Let's heal up. A lot of Ice Pokemon to fight, but if I can get level 30, then I'll just be set with Ribbing. Don't have to use him for a while. Growlithe, that's a fire type. That's pretty good. Another Growlithe, awesome. That Intimidate's gonna hurt though. Critical hit doesn't even matter. Whoo, Ribbing is just destroying with the critical hits this game. Like, six episodes in, he's probably had like a good 10, 15 critical hits. He's a monster. Now he's level 30. Nice. I love ripping. Uh, let's go to this dude. There's a lot of ice Pokemon. We just go for flame charges. Oh, it's Sneasel. If this if this hack didn't have Fakimon, 100% I would capture you. I really fancy using a Weavile. I haven't used one in a long time. But new Pokemon over old Pokemon in this playthrough anyway. Full Restore. Not bad. That's not bad. That's actually really, really good. If the gym leader is up here, he is really far away from his gym. Ooh, Snowcrest City. Oh, I'm guessing he's the fourth gym leader. He has to be. I reckon there's a gym leader in this town. I lived here for years and I've always been cold. Here, you might as well take this. Ooh, a scarf. Thank you. I will treasure it. So, hey, talk to me, dude. Just made it through Avalanche Mountain. It's a long hike and the only way back is to go through there again. Awesome! Or you could use an escape rope, end up in a completely new area and crash the game, which I did. Always, always good. Oh, I should save it, because I've not saved it in a while. Just in case something bad happens, you know? Glitches suck. Let's check this house out. How you doing, boy? Look, I found this in the snow! Never mind, nice, it's mine now! Haha! -ha. Run away! Shouldn't show me things, I will steal them. The name Raider lives in this town? Hey, Rachel, pick one of the nicknames and change them for you. That's nice to know. Guess this is the house here, isn't it? Yep. What are you doing? Look, when I run, it leaves footprints in the snow. Cool. Foltsy, just beat this guy. Or just beat this gym, sorry. It's about time you showed up. Yeah, I know. Let's have a quick battle. I'm down. I'm down. Level 30. Damn, let's switch out. To our Feraligator. A nice fang. Damn, that's really strong. Luxio, let's go into Dreadrock. Level 32, ouch. We need to maybe do a bit of training then. If you're gonna be that strong. Let's learn Bite, yes. Perswine, let's go back into Feraligator. Go for a lovely water gun. Oh, oh, you got the freeze hacks! I'm gonna have to use my full restore now. Damn, of course you get the freeze hacks. And magma. Ooh. 
sucks for you, but I can just... Oh god. Snap out confusion. Water gun's not doing as much as I was hoping. No way, you're still stronger than me? You say this every time I beat you, like, no way, you're stronger than me? Yes, of course I'm stronger than you. Wow, you're still as strong as I remember. You should have no trouble with this gym. I'm off to my next fight. See you, Voltsy. Alright, see you, buddy. I wonder what type this gym is. The Ice Cold Trainer. Ooh, definitely a fire type gym. <laughs> Actually, I think it was uh, Pokemon Gaia I played. It was the uh, top of the snowy mountain. The gym in that area was a fire type gym. Which was really cool because obviously you know, it might catch people off guard and whatnot. That's really, I, I really like that. But this is definitely a nice type gym. Um, ice puzzles are awesome. We're going to lead off with our lovely bug. Yeah, and just uh, flame charge everything. Like so. And Drudge Rock can get some XP as well. Oh, this is going to be annoying. Nice. I really hate ice puzzles so much. Ooh, the yeah, gym leader looks pretty cool. Kinda like the design from here. Well, the outer sprite looks quite nice. And a sneasel. Flame charge! And one more flame charge. That's a dead end. Okay, uh, let's go like so. Wait, I want to go to that, so I need to go not that way. Bam, bam. No, that's not what I want to do. Damn it! <laughs> I hate this place. I don't even get across that way, to be honest. No, I can't. I think I need to go a different way. Oh no! There you go! Ha! Don't know what it is, but when I... I can do puzzles pretty well. Like, I know, games like Portal, I'm really good at. Other games, I'm pretty decent at puzzles, like solving Easter eggs and like... Call of Duty Zombies, I'm pretty good at solving the puzzles and stuff, but... It comes to ice puzzles in Pokemon, I don't know what it is, my mind just dies. Every single time. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's this type of puzzle just kind of pushing around. I don't know what it is. I just can't do it. Um. Ah, that's how you do it. Oh my god, that seems so simple now. That took way longer than it should have done. My goodness. Okay. Let's uh, heal up and then we already take on the gym leader. Might be a little bit difficult considering we're a little bit underleveled. But to be honest, I think we'll do fine. We'll do fine. Alright, let's go. So, I'm Aurora, the icy cold gym leader. I've trained with ice Pokemon in this town since I was a child. No fire types can stop me. I'll freeze your Pokemon solid. Gonna freeze me like uh, that Polyrath froze Ash's Charizard, are you? Oh wow, Jimmy really looks pretty cool. I like the dress. You're barefoot in an ice gym? Bold. Mr. Takedown. Great start. Get my speed up. Another flame charge. You're going to potion up 100%. But at least I'm going to outspeed a lot of things. Yeah, there's a potion. Come on, give me a crit. Finish it off now. Yeah, use another potion, please. Or not. That's one down. What, two more to go? Cloister. Uh, let's... I know you got ice type moves, but I want to do a little bit of damage with uh, Vine Whip. 
Probably might live one attack, we might not go for like an Aurora Beam, but that's fine. Do as much damage as I can. So I want to go for a headbox, I might get the flinch, but... Rock Blast will do! Come on, Dreadrock! Keep going, buddy, you got this! All you can do is protect! Oh, critical hit! And you've done it! My Dreadrock! Lose with 3 HP! What a babe! What a babe! A rough ski. What is a rough ski? Oh my god, I want that Pokemon! It's so adorable! I want it! I want it so bad! I never know until right this moment that's the Pokemon I want the most in my life. It's so adorable! I need this Pokemon! I need to know where you can capture this. I'm going to check the Pokedex after. I will go through Avalanche Mountain. I will check the snowy grass. I will find that Pokemon. I will capture it. I need this. I need it bad. That egg will go in the box, 100%. Get that flame charge, speed boost, and bam! We now have three badges. Level 30, nice. You, you sure surprised me. Here, this is the Arctic badge. Good work. Thank you very much. Much appreciate it. With the Arctic badge, you can fly anywhere you want at any time. Of course, you'll need the move Fly too. Here's my favorite TM. Aurora Beam. Avalanche. Cool. Right. Is that Pokemon going to show where the location is? I thought it was called Rough Ski, wasn't it? Rough Ski, Rough Ski. That 100% has to evolve as well, but it's level 34, so I'm not too sure. Either way, I want it. Okay, we can definitely capture it in the grass just below. So I'm going to try and find one. 100% I need to find one. So, I might be here a while trying to find one. I'm going to try about good. Five, ten minutes. See if I can find one. If not, I'll see you back here in a bit. Okay, so I looked for a very long time. I could not find one. It really sucks. I really want a rough ski. But they just did not appear. Maybe like the 1%, 5% chance of finding one because I searched for like 100, 200 battles. Did not find one. That is very disappointing. But with that, I'm going to end this part right here. Next episode, I believe... All that's left to do is go back down to Slate City, maybe the gym leader will be there now, battle them and then go to the police department and start the uh, the quest to work for them. Anyway, thank you guys for watching, I'll see you next time, have a great day, thanks for watching, peace.